Hello again. Uh, so I actually made a great recording of how Yudi was made and then it cut off after like 9 minutes and 40 seconds and I think I did like 13 minutes. Yikes. So I'm still learning about my camera. So I already set a timer to warn me in 9 minutes, shut up and shut off and wrap up. <laughs> right, Asana? My uh, Shiba Inu is just sitting on the floor in front of me staring at me awkwardly. What? Don't whine. Get up here. Get up here. Come here. Come here. You can talk with me. Come on. 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 Oh my gosh. It was so scary getting out here. Uh, so this is uh, Shiba. This is Shiba. This is Asuna. She's my Shiba Inu. She's just a little over a year old now. She loves to lick and kiss and chew on my fingers and toes and my face. Um, so I was going to talk about the creation of Yudi. So in October of last year I did my first drawing of her. Uh, I did mostly want like a wolf um, body set but I did want dragon in it as well. Uh, the reason being is I am I consider myself a wolf because of the whole pack leadership thing and I am a pack oriented person. I have friends and family that are associated with me and I care for them very deeply and would drop anything to help them at any point in time. She's really intent on what's going on in the camera lens because she could see her reflection. Uh, as for the dragon part, I am very easy to anger. Um, I just have a very slow way of showing it. More of a spiteful person. Um, I'm actually really calm right now because she's sitting on me. I'm not as flamboyant. So that I think is the main reason I put dragon in there because of the temperamental issue, not so much of a like ha 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 gold. Um, other people have other reasons for picking dragon. I picked it because temperament, uh, emotionally <laughs> unstable is how I would put UD as. And then a lot of people ask about the wings and suggest that she's an angel and I say no she's not dead. Uh, she's actually um, after I met Elios Griffin I really wanted a portion of Griffin in her so I added the wings and originally they're chibi type that was my heater sorry it's snowing outside. Um, <clears throat> I wanted them to be chibi but then in my storyline I make them to where she can expand them, make them disappear, or just have them like really small and chibi anime like. Um, so I do have that drawing I can show real quick if somebody will cooperate and not flail, flail, sail. <laughs> she don't care. She don't mind. She really doesn't. This is actually my sketchbook from high school. I really don't use it. Okay, so this was my original drawing concept. Huzzah. So I did use a base because I cannot draw. Like, uh, I could draw swords really well. That was my sword concept. Ah, uh D&D -huh, &D status. It's pretty nice, right? Um, I, I like drawing Inuyasha-like stuff. Um, I was still learning how to draw anime back in high school. Oh my god, yeah, look at this nightmare. You see that? That's scary. That's like, ooh. Um, anime was like what got me started on drawing and then after high school I just kind of quit because after seeing everybody with such better creations than what I came up with I was just like no they can perfect that I'm just gonna sit over here in a corner and sob. Uh, so anyways back to Yudi. <laughs> so originally uh, I had her have scales actually on her arms I took that out uh, it seemed really unique, but I thought if I ever did get a suit, that would be a pain in the butt to work with, so I took it out. Um, I originally had these gargoyle-like feet. I really liked the structure of them and having three toes. Uh, another thing is the floppy ear. I wanted one floppy ear and one straight up because I didn't want them both up. I didn't want them both down. I wouldn't have these on it. 
Uh, I did decide to have scales along the bridge of the nose. I hope that's not too loud and you guys can still hear me. I wonder if I should shut the door. Uh, I'll just talk a little louder. Because I really can't shut the door because the tripod leg is in the door. And the do I wanted the dog to be able to come in and out. Sorry! So, uh, scales specifically on the nose, underneath the eyes I had five, and then the tail itself has seven along the bottom, and then it has the poofy end, so that's the dr dragon. The body structure was mostly woof, except for the feet, which were more dragon-like. Uh, the ears, dog-like, canine. All the scales, dragon. Uh, the eyes, the iris, dragon. So, and the only thing that was griffin was technically the wings. So, and like I said, they can change size and whatnot. So that was my original drawing's concept of beauty. Uh, my first art piece, I believe, was by Reva Latka on FA. Uh, she did a wonderful job. I didn't know exactly how it was going to turn out because this was my first commission, so I didn't know. Um, and actually my first badge, which technically was my first art piece, was done by uh, Bear Asses, or Lanouve, I think is how you pronounce it. Uh, she used to live here in Colorado Springs. She was a local. Hi, if you're watching, I miss you. Uh, she did a wonderful job at my first badge. I was very excited to get it. Um, kind of made an ass of myself, as I usually do when I meet people of a new fandom, because I'm just like, how do I act in front of people? I'm so strange. Um, so that's originally the concept of beauty. Um, I don't really have a backstory for her. She's one of the only characters that I've had that I haven't created a backstory. I have like the art, the character, like herself, but I don't have an outline or a biography. So if you guys want me to come up with one or tell you some things about her, I'd be more than happy to. Um, she's pretty much based off of me, in the sense, I mean, there's still some differences, of course. Um, wow, this video seems really short compared to my other one. I feel like I'm missing out on content. But I have like a two minute, one minute left before it, like, cuts me off. So, uh, in my last failed attempt video, I kept saying, um, so I asked uh, you guys to post in the comments what I should say instead of um. So if it was Taco Bell, I wouldn't say um anymore to gather my thoughts because I say that a lot apparently. I would say Taco Bell, gather my thoughts and be like, so anyways, blah, 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 blah. And then if I lost it again, just Taco Bell, da, 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 da. So I think... That's it on the creation of beauty. Um, I didn't do a TMI Tuesday yet because it is Tuesday and I just so happened to be able to record today and I fixed the manual focus on my camera so hopefully it's not doing that thing. I really need just a new camera, I need a new computer because the Adobe's not working anymore and no editor is working and I'm not about to pay somebody to do it for me because I'm broke AF, friends. That's why I moved to this apartment to pay less. <laughs> ha, pay less shoes. Uh, yeah, I think that's it on uh, the creation of UD. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, ask in the comments below. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it, thought I was amazing. Give me a thumbs down and put down there why. See, that's my, that's my cutoff time. I have like 30 seconds now. So just uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. If there's certain content you want me to put in of my other OCs or art. I'm definitely going to do an art one because it's very important in the fandom, I believe. So I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Great start to 2017. And don't forget to bring your kazoo. Thanks, guys. We'll see you later.